Welcome to today's DDRX. Uh, today I'll be talking about the different levels of faith so that you can check yourself and see uh, the area you need to grow. I said we all have a measure of faith at salvation and it's our responsibility to grow, to exercise our faith. In fact, there was a time the disciples of Jesus came to him and they said, Master, increase our faith increase our faith. Paul also wrote in 1 Thessalonians 3.10, said, night and day praying exceedingly that we may see your face and perfect what is lacking in your faith. So whatever is lacking in your faith, you can grow your faith. You can grow it in prayer. Prayer can perfect your faith. So there are different types. In fact, many types, many levels of faith. I will just I like just a few of them. One is common faith. And everyone starts with this common faith. Titus 1.4 talks about to Titus a true son in our common faith. So common faith, that's the lowest level. Then we have little faith. And this grows from common to little in Matthew 6.30. Now if God clothes the grass of the field, which today is and tomorrow is thrown into the oven, Will he not much more clothe you, O oh, you of little faith? So, you know, little faith trusts God for daily needs. Then we have wavering faith in James 1, 5 to 8. We also have strong faith in Romans 4, 20. Romans 4, 20. The Bible says that Abraham did not waver the promise of God through unbelief but was strengthened in faith, giving glory to God. So, strong faith refuses to say no for an answer. It refuses to say no for an answer. And we also have great faith in Matthew 8, 10. You know, great faith recognizes authority. The centurion told Jesus not to come to his house, but to speak the word. And Jesus really appreciated his faith. Then we have active faith in James 2, 15. Faith that is doing and working continuously. So you can see there are many levels of faith. In fact, we have victorious faith. You know, uh, victorious faith just like the woman with the issue of blood. That woman just proposed in her mind. She saw something and she touched the hem of Jesus' garment. So I want you to check your faith meter with these levels of faith I've shared and see where you need to grow. Thank you.